This video is intended for adult collectors or adults who want an nostalgia fix, not for kids. Although children may appear in this video, they are in it for review purposes only. If you are a child, please make sure to get your parents' permission before watching and make them watch it with you. ¿Qué onda? This Hector Canal is bringing you a quick unboxing review of the 2020 Mattel's WWE Target Exclusive SummerSlam Series, Miss Elizabeth. Elizabeth comes in this wonderful SummerSlam packaging, showcasing this beautiful figure. She only comes with one accessory, extra hands, unless you count her majestic outfit. On the sides, there are a couple of iconic pictures of her. And on the back, you've got a small bio of her involvement in SummerSlam 88 and the other figures in this series that you can collect. Let's get to this unboxing. Let's go ahead and smell her. She smells great. It's not as strong as The Fiend's brand new smell, but it's a brand new toy smell, so it's always great. Let's take a quick look around. She looks very elegant, as Miss Elizabeth always looked. The face isn't so Miss Elizabeth. Maybe it has something to do with the thick lipstick that makes her look a little more like Sensational Sherry than Miss Elizabeth. I do think the head sculpt is a little better than the previous Miss Elizabeth. Let's take a look at the pink job. Let's take a look at the nails. Now here's a look at the other hands she comes back with. Let's take a look at her high heels. Before we continue on looking at her fancy dress, let's take a look at her articulation. She's got articulation at her head, side to side, up and down, just a little bit because of her 80s poofy hair. She's got shoulder articulation, G.I. Joe swivel arm, elbow articulation, wrist articulation, ab crunch articulation, waist articulation, thigh articulation, hip articulation, knee articulation, double jointed, and ankle articulation. We can see just how elegant she looks in her mega power dress. And let's take a closer look at it. So her dress is real claw. It's got Velcro back here. It's got that cute little flower, but unfortunately it's not really detailed. If you see, it's just this little poofy here. I also love the fact that there's Velcro on the side right here. If you know the results of the Mega Powers versus the Mega Bucks, you know what happens at the end. Now comparing her with the then, now, and forever Miss Elizabeth that was released as a Walmart exclusive, you can see the improvements that they've made. I really like this Miss Elizabeth, but her eyes are just too big. I know they're trying to make her look very innocent and give her these doughy eyes, but realistically her eyeballs are just way too big. I do love the soft lipstick that they gave her. Scope wise is so much better, but that lipstick, real dark red lipstick is still bothering me. This Miss Elizabeth, uh, she's got no sideburns. She looks like she has a mullet. She looks more like Marty Jannetty from the side. I love the Mega Powers Miss Elizabeth's hair. It looks fantastic. It's just something about that face. A little something about that face. I think it's that lipstick. This is how I've had Miss Elizabeth displayed. Let's swap her in with the Mega Powers, Miss Elizabeth. And this looks amazing. I was a huge, and I still am, I'm a huge Mega Powers fan. This was, for me, this was the pinnacle of my fandom as a kid in the breakup at WrestleMania 5 when the Mega Powers exploded. They got me for life after that. To be able to get a Miss Elizabeth in her Mega Powers colors, to me, it's it's a sign that hopefully, hopefully soon, they're gonna finally make the Mega Powers 2-pack. And now, what everyone's been waiting for, the swimsuit competition.
and just for uh, those curious out there, yes, her top is also removable. Underneath, she is in red and yellow. To put her skirt back on, I find it a lot easier to put her skirt on. Then get her top back on as the top goes over the skirt. Thank you for joining us on this quick unboxing review of Summer Slams Miss Elizabeth. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And join us again on our next quick unboxing review of...